Hey, this is David the Shepherd School. I want to show you one of the tests to see if your soil has got clay in it uh, to see if you can use it to make cob. And I've dug a hole, and you don't want to use the topsoil. You want to dig down a couple feet. Get your post hole digger. Dig down, get you some dirt, all right? And you look at it, you might think, oh, okay, it's red or whatever. You might think it's got clay in it. But just because it's red doesn't necessarily mean it's clay. It could be, uh, you know, it could have iron ore in it. It could have all sorts of stuff. So we've got our uh, our, our uh, dirt, and we're going to add it some water, about half full. And then we're going to add a couple drops of something that's a surfactant, something that's going to break up the uh, surface tension. You could use salt, or you could use a couple drops of dish soap. Okay. I just happened to use dish soap because when I went upstairs, that was the first thing that I saw. Okay. Now what you want to do is you just want to shake this up real good. The better you shake it, the better your results are going to be. I mean, I'm going to get tired to go off camera, but I'm going to come back and shake this some more. Okay. And this ain't nearly as, this ain't nearly good enough, okay? But you get the point. You gotta break this, the dirt up completely. No clods, nothing, just into just fine aerated dirt. Then what you do is you let it sit. And what's gonna happen is as it sits, because of specific gravities, because some things weigh more than others, it's gonna filter out into layers, right? And uh, you'll start to see a difference, you know, start to see a little bit uh, now, but uh, you know, this might take a week or so with just sitting, so uh, don't get impatient. So uh, we're gonna shake this up some more. Shake, shake, shake it up good. But uh, I'm tired, so we're gonna go off camera and we'll come back in about a week and let you see how everything has uh, separated out. Okay, I know it's kind of dark. I don't know how much you could tell, but this is clay. Most of the ground is clay. And that dark band there is silt, just a little bit of silt, probably from where the topsoil and stuff kind of fell in the hole. And then just a little bit of sand. That much sand, that much silt, all the rest of that's clay. Okay, so pretty easy little test. And until next time, you can get to the line www.tngun.com.